<laughs> Real man's, goddammit. That's what a girl told me. She want a real man. I said, motherfucker, you got to be real yourself first. Motherfucker said they want a real man. That's 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 a hard thing to say when everything about you fake, though. Yo, you gotta women's gotta get that shit together, B. You know what I'm saying? Everything fake and then they say they want something real. When you tell a nigga I can't even see you cause your hair ain't done, you wanna go put on some shit that God ain't even gave you. And you tell him I gotta wait for that, that's false advertising. I'm not accepting that shit. That's not who you really are, but you want me to be real. You gotta first be real. Be what you asking me to be. And then tell me you want something real, man. You women are fucking crazy. Fake eyelash, fake hair, fake nails, fake ass, fake stomach, fake hip, fake teeth. And you go, you wanna judge me if you see a nigga with a fake chain? You can't judge a nigga with a fake chain. Everything about you fake. So he, shit, he ain't doing no motherfucking worse than you doing. Oh, you women fucking crazy, B. Get real, then tell somebody you want to be real. You understand what I'm saying? You judge a nigga by his pockets. Now, let me judge you by yours. You understand what I'm saying? You ain't coming with nothing. So how you expect a nigga to have everything when you coming with nothing? You got to first be about something. Lead by example. You understand what I'm saying? And that's just being a hundred. You understand what I'm saying? You asking me for something you ain't even. Now, if you want to say, hey, let's come together and we can do this thing here together, that makes sense to me. You understand what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, don't ask somebody for something that you really not. People are so judgmental, man. You understand what I'm saying? At the end of the day, man, you know what I'm saying? If you want something real, you got to live by that there, man. You can't say, oh, yeah, I want a real man. These niggas ain't this. Nah, you ain't shit. Them the niggas you met ain't shit. You know, I don't go for every nigga just like every woman. I can't say every woman ain't shit. You know, just the ones I met. Some of the ones I met ain't shit. I had some good ones, and I had some ones that ain't shit either. But that's life. You understand what I'm saying? I'm just saying for the ones who sitting there saying all oh, this, that, and all that. I want a real man, and I want a man, and this, and man. Then when they get the nigga, they got all type of trust issues. They got problems, and he ain't this, and all bunch of bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Come on, man. You can't bring that past in the future, man. You can let that shit stay where it at, because that's what the last nigga did. And I ain't going to live my life, you know what I'm saying, paying for what another nigga did. That's stupid as fuck to me. I'm not gonna accept that responsibility for what he did. Let me make my own mistakes. How would you? How would you want me? To, how would you feel? If God charged you for everything another person did. Same thing. Do you understand what I'm saying? You know how many people do God wrong every day. Shit, you don't want to get held accountable for what all them people done did. So why are you holding me accountable for what another nigga did? That's what he done wrong. And people just keep hitting me with that bullshit. I'm like, listen, all the real man talk where well, first of all, take all that shit off your body. Let me see what God did for you. Then we can go from there. But the minute you tell me I can't see you because your hair ain't done, you don't violate all rights of me for a quote. Motherfucker, you got to first be real for you ask somebody else to be real, man. You understand what I'm saying? I'm just being a hundred, man. There's too much fake shit out here, man. You know what I'm saying? There ain't enough real out here, man. These women are getting out of control with this shit out here. Just like some of these niggas getting out of control. A lot of these women getting out of control. If you ain't got no answers because it wasn't meant for you to have none. You understand what I'm saying? Y'all going to get the injections and all. I don't mind you getting your little stomach and all that shit dead. Because you done had your couple kids. You want to get that little pulge out. That's fine. But all that stupid shit you about to go do, that's stupid, man. The one thing about a nigga, we don't need all that. Y'all do that shit for y'all. You understand what I'm saying? Because real talk, a nigga, a real man don't care nothing about half of that shit right there, boy. I'm, all that shit don't mean nothing when you ain't got no credit. You ain't got no money. You ain't got no goddamn standards. You ain't got no morals, no ethics, no values, no nothing. You just worthless. You just a bad bitch with no values, no nothing. But then you say, hey, I want this. Hey, you, don't, you don't deserve that because you don't know the first thing about being a woman. You got to first know how to be a woman for her. You can't even put them Garcia sausage I cooked in there. You can't even put them Garcia's and that Raymond noodles together like I did. You can't, you, you, you can't be my woman if you can't put them Garcia's in the pan. Shit. I mean, let me tell her, I think I'm a bad motherfucker. And you got to better match me in the kitchen. That being a hard day. Now, you have a good day to the woman who said this shit to me earlier.
ain't worth a fuck. 